Welcome back. For some reason, I chose one of the hottest days of the year to go outside and try this new tool my wife bought to remove hair from dogs. It's over 100 degrees outside, and I'm sweating like I stole something. But let's see how it works. It definitely doesn't feel like something that you would use to remove hair. I'd describe it as jagged, rigid, and kind of sharp. Definitely unlike the brushes I've used in the past. It's extremely effective. Look at the hair coming off of him. Tonka's just odd. For some reason, he wants to eat the hair. The coarseness, the rigidness of this tool doesn't seem to bother him at all. But then again, Tonka just likes to be touched. That feel good, Papa. That feel so good. Look at all that hair. I can actually off. see the hair and dander coming off of him. Yeah, it's supposed to get rid of that too, baby. I'll give him a bath after this. Good boy, Papa Papa. No, you stay there with Daddy. He's trying to get in the shade or in the pool. Tonka does great with all phases of grooming, except getting his nails done. Then it's all out war. Even as a puppy, he never liked his feet touched. He's gotten used to it. He knows he has to do it, but he doesn't like it. We use a Dremel tool and he doesn't like the feel or the sound of it. We can get away with grooming his nails once or twice a month. His nails don't grow very fast, unlike Veloxes, who basically needs a nail trim every week. Tonka actually likes the way this feels. Maybe it's sort of like a massage. I had always heard that Connie Corsos don't shed very much, but that's definitely not the case with these two. Her flank was like that too. Look at all that hair coming off his flank. And there he goes trying to eat more hair. That's just weird. Hopefully grooming them consistently with this tool will reduce the hair in the house. Gosh. You still got more off her though. Well, you know, we just talked about that. Her being it's good one. Good girl, mommy. Velox is not enjoying this. But again, she knows she has to. So she won't put up too much of a fuss. Good girl. Good girl, I'll leave a link to this tool in the description for those of you interested in purchasing one. I definitely recommend it. It removes a lot of hair quickly. I would definitely recommend doing it outside so that you don't get hair everywhere. Maybe not in direct sunlight when it's 103 degrees outside, but you know what I mean. You can see she's starting to get used to it. Courses don't shed. Lie. You see this? Yes, baby. Oh my. If you notice, a lot more hair is coming off of Velox. Both of them have really shiny coats, but Velox's is a lot softer. Tonka's is more coarse. It's hard to believe how much hair this tool removes. She's such a good girl. I'll reward her with some treats when we're done. Good girl, mommy. That will help her associate this tool with a positive experience. I didn't do him wrong because I, I figured out I don't like the camera angle I was getting. Uh -oh. So we're going to do him next. Okay. Well, while you get him off, I might go get in the water. So here's a close up of what it looks like. They come in different sizes. This is the five inch. I believe they come in three, five, and ten inches. Hopefully you can see how jagged and rigid it is. You would think it wouldn't feel good on the dogs, but my dogs seem to like it. 
what do you use to control your dog shedding? Leave a comment. And thanks for watching.